of Glitter and Gold. I'm Beth Minson. I'll be your host for the next couple of minutes. I just actually wanted to use this uh, this week's episode to more so discuss the Penguins' losses and more so the Pittsburgh reaction to the Penguins' losses. Uh, I kind of did an article about it this week for Penn's Initiative, but I wanted to touch upon it for a minute or two more. They were up and down. They actually outplayed Boston the other day, but still couldn't come out with that one, even with uh, some questionable calls uh, by the refs on the ice. So I don't even want to get into that because I'm actually still boiling from it. Uh, had an overtime win against Montreal, a much needed goal by the captain, Sidney Crosby. But I, I'm more so interested in how we react as fans and, and honestly how spoiled we are, myself included, how lucky we are to have a team that's capable of winning any game. I, I, there's no game that I come in and I say Pittsburgh can't win this. There's no way that they can win this. Even with all the injuries, all the ins and outs, all the problems, they find ways to come back and surprise us. Guys step up constantly. Yes, there are issues on the team, mainly in the form of his MVP mind of his own, Craig Adams, but they're consistent, and they're consistently good, and they have 10 regulation losses in mid-January. That's not something that a lot of other teams can can say, and they're, and they're even whenever they're losing, they're forcing games to overtime, and that's amazing. So I just think everybody needs to take a little breather take a step back it'll be okay you have a good team you have a good organization running it we're really lucky uh it'll be okay i promise of course david perron came in last week and that's exciting i still think him and sim kind of need some more time to jive but apart from that the nhl scheduling has been a lot of days off it's been kind of up and down so but i'll be back next week i'm back on the normal schedule I just took some time off for the holidays, and speaking of, I hope everybody had a safe and happy holiday, and I will see you guys next week. Thanks for watching.